Hello, today I'm going to show you what happens if you change file name for resource pool with Microsoft Project Online and what happens if you move resource pool somewhere else. Let me open, you can see that I have a lot of projects here, let me open my first project. And you will see that I am asked if I want to open resource pool. So obviously I'm using resource pool. How can I know that? Resource, resource pool, share resources. You can see I am using file which is called resource pool. Okay, let me open my second project. Okay, and I will go to my second project where it is. Here it is. And I am using the same resource pool. Okay, share resources, same resource pool. Okay, everything is fine. Now, to see that my resource pool is open, read only, okay. Okay, now, let me close that and let me change my resource pool, the name of my resource pool. Here it is, okay, let me change and I will say resource pool for first and second project. Okay, now I have resource pool for first and second project. First project, let me open the first project. Open resource pool, okay, wow. Project cannot file the shared resource pool. Okay, and it says, it is here. I will say okay, what will happen? You will see, I will open the second project as well. Okay. The same thing. Do you want to open resource pool? Yes, the same uh, error message. I cannot find it. So here, if I go to resource sheet, you will see they are not over allocated because they are, <laughs> they are not recognized in resource pool. So back, let's back to resource pool, resource pool, share resources. And you see, I'm using resource pool which doesn't exist anymore. And I can say, okay, I will choose it, but it doesn't exist. So what should I do if I accidentally change it? I can rename it back. So let me go back here. Let me change, every, uh, change it back to, uh, uh, to original name. Okay, so here it is, where it is, here it is. I will change the name as resource pool, okay, here, okay, and when I open my open project, uh, my first project, here it is, where it is, here it is, you will see that I will be able to open resource pool, and they are, over, uh, resources are overallocated because they are using, used by second project as well, or the other thing, if I want to keep that name changed, so resource pool once again for first and second project, then I will go open my first project. I will say, okay, open it, but I have an error. I will open the second one as well, and I will get the same error once again, okay? And I'm going to use, let's say, first project. I will say, okay, go to <coughs> N. Once again, I have to open my new resource pool. Okay, so I'm closing this and I will say, I will open resource pool. And it says, open resource pool to work another project. Okay, open it resource pool, but nothing happens here because if I go to resource and share resources, you will see that I don't have any project connected. So I opened the new, uh, 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 my new or, or old but renamed resource pool and then I'm going back to my first project and I will have to repeat the process, share resources and now I will choose resource pool for first and second project for first project and then go to second project and file, okay, sorry, not file, but uh, a resource, resource pool, share resources, and I will choose that as well. <coughs> sorry, and did I choose it? 
share resources. No, I didn't. And now you can see everything is in order. So that is the first thing what you should be careful. When you change the name of the file which contains resources and serves as a source pool, you will have to attach, to assign that newly named resource pool to all your project which use the previously all named resource pool. Okay, that's the first thing. Now, let me close the second project, okay? And I will say yes, and I will update resource pool. Let me uh, uh, close my first project, the same thing, and let me close my resource pool. I am going out, and let me create a new folder here, okay? New folder on my desktop, which should say resource pool folder, and let me choose my resource pool and move it here. Okay, so it is here now. It is not in my, uh, my uh, uh, desktop. It is under my desktop, under my folder, resource pool folder. Let me open first project. Open resources. Well, same thing, okay? If you move it, you will get the same thing. So I will have to go back, assign resources, sorry, not assign resources, resource pool, share resources, and use resource pool. But not this one. I should go here, here in my, in my, uh, uh, in my, sorry, in my, uh, resource pool folder. I should open resource pool. I will. I should open it, and once again, I should go back to my first project, and I should assign it. I assign resource pool to my project. That the, now, resource pool is not renamed, but it is moved. So I will go to resource. Assign, sorry, not assign resources, once again, resource pool, share resources, and I will say, okay, this one. Okay, everything is fine. Now, let's go back and open second project. Okay, second project is here. Okay, open, I have the same error, resource pool, share resources, and this one. Okay, everything is good now. So be aware when you change the name or change the location of your resource pool, you should, you should reconnect uh, your projects with your resource pool. That's the whole thing. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.